Chelsea, how are the squad feeling going into Friday's uh, SWPL Cup final against Glasgow City? Yeah, it's definitely a game we're looking forward to, so all the squad are really buzzing for it. Uh, we've got time to prepare and that's what we're focusing on just now. Uh, just in terms of that uh, Cup final, how good was the run that the side obviously put together to get to, to the final uh, against Glasgow City? Yeah, I think we've performed really well throughout and obviously it, were, it being a cup that we're trying to retain, there is a lot of pressure on us from other teams expecting us to perform well and I think so far we've definitely done that and we're looking to take that into the final against Glasgow City. I City themselves are obviously uh, quite familiar opponents for yourself and the team, uh, how tough an opposition are they? Uh, we know it's going to be a tough game, Like we've faced them before, obviously we've played them in the league and unfortunately didn't get, quite get the result we wanted but um, I felt personally that we were unlucky there but we forget about that and we focus on the game and it's a completely different game on, on Friday night and um, as long as we pre prepare and do the best we can I think we're definitely in with a chance of winning. You've obviously played Glasgow City earlier this year, what do you feel you maybe learned from that 1-0 defeat? I think as a team we definitely learned a lot from the defeat. Um, I think we obviously deserved more from, from that game but that's the way football is sometimes and having new players we definitely learn how to play against a Glasgow City with the intensity that they play at and it's only going to benefit us. Of course uh, you've played in the last three SWPL Cup finals which have all resulted in victories for Hibs. That's 2016, 2017 and 2018. Uh, just talk us through the, the, the experiences of, the, of, of like winning the trophy for this club. The feeling is unbelievable when you win in a final. Obviously all the hype is around the final and to come out at the end of the 90 minutes or whatever, how long it's took, it's an amazing feeling and the experience I've been able to gain playing up against tough oppositions, players that I maybe never even thought I would play up against has been unbelievable. I was just going to say that you mentioned a little bit there about uh, about your age. You're obviously still really young but got a lot of experience. Uh, what what have you learned from playing in, in matches like that with uh, an awful lot at stake? Uh, personally, I've learned loads but I think one of the main things is how to control my nerves. Personally, I'm a really nervous player and controlling, like, finding, managing my nerves was really difficult for me at the start. But now that I've gained experience, experience, different finals, different oppositions, I manage them and it doesn't affect my performance anymore. And, uh, of course, uh, you've already referenced uh, some new players coming in. They maybe don't have experience playing in, uh, in cup finals. And, uh, you know, what... what can you maybe pass on, and what can some of the uh, some of the more experienced players who've been there and done it with the club uh, pass on to them uh, just ahead of the tie against Glasgow City? Yeah, I think we can pass on a lot. Like we can comfort them, etc. And we just need to reassure them that this is just any other game. Kind of forget the whole hype about it being a final. It is a big game. Just go out and play the way we know you can. And what's it going to take to to be able to add a, a fourth winners' medal for you in this competition on Friday? Uh, I think just preparing well up until Friday, we need to prepare well as a squad and stick together. Um, obviously, Friday is our main focus now, and yeah, we're definitely determined to go for the win.